This is Ben with ITNH, and in this video, I'm going to go over the easier methods to create white in Rasterlink 6. So first off, make sure you have a file loaded and selected, and then go to your special plate window. You can find this on the right side of your screen. In this window, we have access to generating things like clear, primer, and white, depending on the loadout of your machine. So in this case, I'll have to select the white from this drop-down menu. Next, you select the percentage you want to put down. Uh, the machine I'm currently using has two channels, so I can use 100% out of both. The next thing to select is the created area. Whole image is going to generate white on the entire artboard available. Valid pixel will generate wherever it sees CMYK color data, essentially the shape of whatever your image is. Let's show you both real quick. You can see a solid gray preview here of the whole image. Now here, we'll do a valid pixel. And you can see it's a nice little shape previewed in gray, matching up to our logo. Now, you might notice these are standalone files. So I'm removing one at the moment just to show you an easier method. The next option, execution. Here, we can select Composite Automatically. This will link the white directly to your file. If you have Bottom selected, it will be to print the white underneath the color. If you have Top selected, it will be to print the white on top of the color for something like a second surface print on acrylic or glass. So in this case, I'll click Bottom, Create. Now you can see we have a layered linked white to this color. And when you go to print it, it will print white underneath the color.